Mary Kippis was an extremely successful genus of horse which lived in North America over a period of about 10 million years in the Miocene. It was the first to truly resemble modern horses in that it was the first horse truly adapted for grazing. So uh, the grasses which were spreading throughout North America were the primary food source for Mary Kippis. It was larger than any other horse of its day, standing almost 90 centimeters or three feet uh, tall at the shoulder. It apparently traveled in herds. The middle toe was enlarged and supported a hoof. The side toes uh, were much smaller and in some species they only touched the ground while uh, running. And so Murray Kippis uh, began to show many of the features characteristic of the modern one-toed horses. In the late Miocene, Murray Kippis had evolved into a number of successful species, including a few groups of smaller horses, such as Protohippus and Callippus, three-toed browsing horses of the Hipparian group, such as Hipparian, Neohipparian, Stylohipparian, Cormohipparian, and Pseudohipparian. Some of these species migrated to Eurasia and Africa and became quite successful there as well. In addition, the ancestors of the one-toed horses evolved from the Merikippus group. 